So I've previously created a, a short video, which is on my YouTube channel, just about how we can insert um, check mark options here with Google's new feature, uh, as if we're doing an attendance register and things that's, uh, of that nature. And that's just through the insert menu and tick box. And what I'm going to do here, I'm just going to insert count if and just count up the number of people that have attended all sessions. So I'm looking for the result that is true. It tells me that seven people attended all of the sessions and these are their test scores at the end of it. What I'd like to do is sort this a little bit better. So I'm going to come up here and I'm going to come to data and sort range. And I'm going to sort by those who've attended sessions. And that pulls these all together for me. Uh, and now if I highlight all of these and I go to data, I've got the option to group those particular um, cells together. So I'm going to group those cells or I can group these cells. So it's entirely up to me. So actually, what we're going to do is ungroup those ones. And what I want to do, in actual fact, is group these ones because I want to hide them. So I'm going to go to data, I'm going to go to group, group rows two to eight. And then I click on this little minus here and they suddenly disappear. So now I can only see what we've got here. And then we can work out very quickly very easily there we go the average score and we can format that um, to be um, any particular format we like so if you're not 100 percent sure um, that's how you do that so a really handy little tool at any point if we want to see the other data that we've grouped together and hidden we can just click on the plus and it will bring it back again but you can notice that it hasn't changed the average score it's not counting because we've grouped them all together and again we can hide them very easily and at any point you can just right click and ungroup those rows again so really quite handy little tool